everybody. Uh, we're going to be reusing this uh, approximately 13 inch round MDF board that I have coated in some uh, White House paint initially with a roller and then it's just got some white that I spilled pouring this on it that I've spread around with my hand. Um, so yeah, we're going to try and use a hairdryer in this painting. So all my colours are a mix now. This is my same Spring White House paint mixed with Flow Troll. But there wasn't much left. So what I did was added some titanium white from Creative Place and a dash of uh, Atelier Pouring Medium. Um, and combined the two together. So, just going to spread this to the edges, and but use that area there. So, my colours for this one are also mixed. It's a mixed bag, quite a variety. <laughs> um, yeah, so they're all creative place yep thought I better double check that <laughs> and so they are um, this has got ultramarine ultramarine deep cobalt blue white uh, titanium white and then the pouring medium and flow troll so I'm going to pop that one in here down there. So what we'll do, we'll actually turn it this way. And this one is a coral colour that I made. Um, excuse my little man in the background. Alright, so yeah, this coral colour was created from crimson, cadmium yellow hue and titanium white. And then we have this nice turquoise colour. So that was from cobalt blue, emerald green and titanium white. So. There we go. So with this I want to blow the white over the colours and then blow them out. So let's see if I have enough. I want to create an extra extra pile of white on that side and then because I'm going to blow them out all right let's see how we go all right there will be noise from the hairdryer sorry how I've still got the sections of white, the colours mixing, blending. I just want to force this bit without too much of it moving. I know. I know, I know. Hang on. Let's see. Just need a straw. 
Okay, so I'll just blow this section. Just wanted to get that off the edge. It looked like it was creating a bit of a um, crease, I think. Okay. All right, so let's give it a torch. Um, some of those paints actually, I think the coral color was the only one that didn't have um, silicon. So I'm just trying to get out a lot of the bubbles and there's also some cells popping up that I may not be particularly fond of but we can see how we can alter that if need be. So I saw a bit of gunk while I was doing that here. I think I got it and saw another one okay I can't see it now but I'm just going to drop in it seems like the ones that I thought might the cells that I thought might explode I don't like this one very much. And you know what? I'm going to go with it and just see. So, um, yep. I will add a link in the description below to, uh, I think it's Rinsky's uh, YouTube channel, so you can have a look if you choose to. Um, seem, comes across very lovely, um, is good value I believe and well worth it if you're interested. Got a few more bubbles. Okay. Yeah, it's different. <laughs> okay. Looks like I also have a bit of a lip happening here. Just need to encourage that over. There we go. Just encourage it. Don't force it. Excellent. All right, let's have a close-up. So this is how it looks closer up. You've got the gorgeous colours coming through. Some cells. Some mixed colours. Your negative white space. And background. So there we have it. We'll see how it goes. Um, we are using this board for the second time, but it accidentally got three layers of paint from my spilling of the house paint with the flow drop. And yeah, so we'll set it aside now and see how it dries. If you've enjoyed this, please subscribe if you haven't already. Uh, give me a thumbs up. 
leave me a comment below and share with others who might appreciate it. It all helps and it's all greatly appreciated. All right, thank you so much. Be kind, be creative, and be fabulous. Bye.